So you're looking to replace your cooling system. And while looking at products, you come across something that says either single stage, two stage, or variable speed. What does that mean? And what's the difference between each stage? In this video, we'll compare single stage, two stage, and variable speed cooling to show you the benefits that each stage has to offer. Hi, I'm Jared from Fire and Ice. And regardless if you're replacing just an air conditioner or a full system, you need to make sure your units match or rate in terms of single stage, two stage, or variable speed. In this video, we'll sit down with Arnie Jacobson, a residential sales professional for Fire and Ice. And we'll cover what's the difference between single stage, two stage, and variable speed cooling? What are the benefits of each stage? What's an example of a product in each stage? Who would be a right fit for each type of stage? And finally, what to do next. By the end of this video, you'll know the difference between single stage, two stage, and variable speed cooling, and what stage would be right for you. So Arnie, let's just jump in and start at the beginning. What is single stage cooling? Uh, a single stage air conditioner is an air conditioner that operates at its full capacity all the time. So 100% capacity all the time. Uh, when we size air conditioners uh, in, in this area, we size them for when it's 88 degrees outside. That's when they need to be at 100% at capacity. Benefits of a single stage air conditioner is lower initial costs and also the ability to be able to cool the home uh, that it's actually designed for. Some of the examples of a single stage air conditioner are the XR14 uh, air conditioners and the XL16 air conditioners. The right fit for a single stage air conditioner would be a customer that has a smaller square footage home and or that they don't have temperature swings in the house. That's great. Now let's go over what is two-stage cooling? A two-stage air conditioner is an air conditioner that has uh, multi-stages of cooling. And the first stage usually operates at about 60-65% of capacity and then the second stage operates at 100% capacity. A two-stage air conditioner is going to have the ability to uh, be able to remove moisture much better uh, because it does have a little longer run time, but those run times are using less energy. The example of a product that has two stages of cooling would be an XR17 model as well as an XL18 model. The right fit for uh, a two-stage air conditioner would be a homeowner that is having uh, issues controlling temperatures throughout the house. If they have a two-story home, a multi-stage would be a much better fit for them. Okay, Arnie, so what's variable speed cooling? Variable speed cooling is a outdoor unit with a compressor that actually uh, varies in stages. It actually, it starts at 35% and goes up to 100%. And it's all based on the outdoor temperature, the indoor uh, temperature, the run time that the, is needed. The benefits of a variable speed air conditioner is you have better temperature control in the house to within a half a degree or less. You're going to have better uh, humidity control. The example of a product that has variable speed technology that would be the XV18 air conditioner and the uh, XV20 air conditioner. Homes that are a little larger again and have uneven temperature swings and higher humidity, those would be a, a better candidate for the variable speed. Hey, thanks a lot, Arnie. If you would like more information about single stage, two stage, or variable speed systems, click the link in the description below. If you found this video helpful, feel free to subscribe and hit that bell icon to be notified when we release a new video. Thank you for watching, and we're looking forward to making your day better.